What's going on everybody? So I uh, had a little dilemma, you could call it, um, at the shop here yesterday. Um, I was actually leaving work and Jeff texts me and he goes, hey dude, uh, your room's like 90 degrees, it's super hot in there, the air conditioner's not working. And I'm like, all right, well, I gotta pick up my little guy and I'll be there. So I get here, um, find out the breaker's tripped, try to reset the breaker and it's just like bzz, it just goes crazy well long story short um so I, I come in and i unplug the air conditioner and i notice it's really hard to unplug um the uh like the prongs on the plug were like kind of corroded had a little bit of corrosion and stuff uh, probably just from moisture obviously um so i unplug the the plug and I go and I try and reset the breaker again. Well, it stays on. So that tells me something's obviously wrong with the air conditioner. So I come back in and I try to plug the air conditioner in again. And as soon as I do, it's like, bzz, you know what I mean, trips, boom. And I'm like, well, all right. So air conditioner shot, it's got a short in it or something. You know what I mean? So I call, uh, I call old Marcus up and I'm like, hey buddy, could you, um, you know, help me swap out this air conditioner? I have another air conditioner as a spare. Um, it's just the one that I have is it's a 110 volt instead of the one like the one I have now is um, I believe it's 220, and you know different plug. Anyway, point is the one that's in there now is bigger than the one that I had as a spare. So I'm about to show you what I had to do yesterday just to make it by until today when um, Marcus could come down and help me swap it out. So this is what I had to do. <laughs> I had to, I put it on a trash can and taped up some like black um, plastic paper. It's almost like tarp. I, I, don't, I don't remember what you'd call it, but it's really like super thick plastic. So uh, yeah, that's what I did. And it, I mean, it worked. Obviously, it cooled the room down. It was like 76 or 74 or something in there when I got here today. So uh, we're about to get this out of the way and uh, get the old air conditioner out and put this one in. So we got the old uh, the old air conditioner out. Uh, Marcus started on some of the framing. Oh, there he is. Um, he's on the outside now, getting ready to put some more in. Um, you can see the new one was a lot smaller, so we had to basically just reframe it in. So uh, almost done with that now. Getting ready to wrap it up and we'll get the new one in. All right, so air conditioner is in. Just got some uh, finishing touches to do. Um, you can see a little bit of gap there, a little one on the other side. Um, we're just gonna take some like foam, like some great stuff or whatever and uh, foam it in and she should be uh, good to go. All right, so she's in, she's plugged in. Uh, this is just temporary, the cord. Uh, it wouldn't reach the outlet, so I had to put an extension cord to an outlet over here. Um, basically just a temporary thing just so I can make sure to get it going and um, get some cool air starting to go in here uh, I guess I'll give you a little peek of the frag tank uh, my powder blue tang I've had him for a long time him or her I'm, I honestly don't know what it is or even how you tell but um, 
Yeah, so these look like crap right now. This is the fish system. Uh, I did a video on this uh, a while ago now. Um, I'm actually I'm tearing it down and I'm actually gonna set up another tank like that that I set up for the puffer and whatnot. Uh, it's gonna be another frag tank. I'm, getting, I'm gonna get away from selling the fish and just do coral. Um, being like online, I, uh, it's just gonna be easier to ship coral than it is a fish. Uh, I could guarantee, basically night and day, not even night and day comparison to like the live arrival of a fish compared to a coral. So, uh, but yeah, so that's that, and that's why it kind of looks like crap. Um, there's not hardly even any fish in the tanks. So um, that's the next step. I'll be tearing that down and getting that frag tank set up. But as always, I appreciate you watching. If you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button, and uh, you have a good day.